Easter morning by George Baker. Too early, of course, how provoking. I told my just how it would be. I might as well have on a wrapper, for where isn't a soul here to see? There's who the Lafine's pew is empty, I declare if it isn't too bad. I know my suit cost more than hers did, and I wanted to see her look mad. I do think that Sexton's so stupid, he's put someone else in our pew, and the girl's dress just kills mine completely. Now what am I going to do? Upsalda and Sue isn't here yet, I don't care. I think it's a sin for people to get late to service, just to make a great show coming in. Perhaps she's sick and can't get here. She said she'd a hell like last night. How mad she'll be after her fussing. I declare it would serve her just right. Oh, you've got here at last, my dear, have you? But I don't think you need be so proud of that bonnet if we really did make it. It's hard fast looking and loud. What a dress for a girl in the senses to go on the street in light blue. And those coat sleeves they wore them last summer and don't dope though that she thinks were new. Mrs. Grey Polonaise was important, so dreadful a minister's wife. And thinking so much about fashion, a pretty example of life, the old house dressed sweetly. I wonder who sent those white flowers for the fun. Some girl who's gone on the assistant, done doped it was Bessie Lamont. Just look at her now, little humbug. So devoted, I suppose she don't know that she's bending her head too far over, and the ends of her switches all show. What a sigh, Mrs. Ward is this morning, but a woman will kill me some day with a horrible lilacs and crimsons. Why were these old things dressed so gay? And where's Jenny Wells with Fred? Tracy, she's engaging to him the whole thing. Dear me, I'd keep on my glove sometimes, if I did have a solitary ring. How can this girl next to him act so, the way that she turns around and stares, and that makes remarks about people? She'd better be saying a prayer, so dear, what a dreadful long sermon. He must laugh to hear himself talk. And it's after twelve now, how oh, provoking. I wanted to have a nice walk through at last. Well, it isn't so dreadful after all, for we don't dine till one. How can people say church is pokey so wicked? I think it's real fun.